Hi, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com and today I want to share with you Play-Doh scissor skills. This is, this is really great for developing fine motor skills and beginning scissor skills. You'll need to have Play-Doh and some type of scissors. This is just regular Play-Doh scissors. You can also use uh, child safe scissors. And this is optional but a little rolling pin um, that will roll out the Play-Doh flat. The first activity that you can do with Play-Doh that will help develop scissor skills is just have the children Take the Play-Doh out of the can, or you can take it out for them, and then that they would knead it like this, and then they would begin to roll it into like a snake, just a long snake, like so. And then when they've got that fairly long, they could take their scissors and then start to cut little pieces off the Play-Doh, like so. This Play-Doh is obviously thicker and um, harder to cut through than paper, so it's excellent for, you know, these pincer, gra pincer grasps and the fine motor skills development. And they would just cut away onto, uh, I, use my, I use a cookie sheet for this activity, but you don't have to, but I like to keep everything contained in an area. And the cookie sheets are um, very expensive if you go to the dollar store or if you have a big lot, it's usually about a dollar there and you can get one for everybody in your early learning environment and again you just would cut. That would be one of the um, Play-Doh cutting skills. And then as a follow-up to this if you want you could have the children sort colors and they could count how many of um, the pieces they've cut off if they want. You could sort and then count with this. Another activity you can do is with your rolling pin or maybe a plastic um, glass if you have one would be to roll out the play-doh again you would want to knead it first so it's nice and mushy push it down and then the children would uh, push on it and roll it so it's kind of flat you don't want this too thick if they want they can try and make a square or a rectangle shape with it but it really doesn't matter and then they would lift this up, this piece up, and they could use their scissors on this as well to cut pieces off. Anything that just gets their fingers moving is very helpful to develop those uh, fine motor skills. And there's so many things you can do with Play-Doh. Um, but this is definitely a great activity right here. For Play-Doh Scissor Skills, I'm Shelly Levette with ChildCareLand.com. And thanks for watching.